Hello, welcome to Megor's technical support video series, Frequently Asked Questions. In this video, we will discuss lead setup and connections to the Megor MWA 300 series winding analyzer. Let's get started. The three-phase universal lead set simplifies connecting to any transformer. All of the leads can be connected at once. Lead spans range from 15 feet to 100 feet ensuring you can connect and test any transformer configuration. The durable Kelvin clamps extend up to 3 inches for connecting to any bushing size. The clamps also accept safety banana plugs making it easy to connect the three-phase lead set to a CT terminal block. Electrical shock and potential markings are clearly displayed on the clamp informing operators how to connect safely and securely. Let us look at the primary and secondary connections. The primary cable receptacle has red marking around the female connector to ensure leads coming only from the primary winding are connected. Similarly, the secondary cable receptacle has black marking around it for secondary leads. Connecting rings for both male and female connectors have grooves marked along the circumference to ensure correct orientation. Once the connectors are inserted into the panel, a one-fourth turn locking mechanism will secure the connection. The new lead set has color-coded connectors. For the primary side, end connections are silver colored with each phase designated by separate colors. Similarly, the secondary side has black colored end connections with each phase designated by separate colors. The new leads can be connected to the MWA using Amphenol to XLR adapters. In addition to the MWA, the new lead set can also be utilized with existing MTOs and TTRs. Once the leads are connected to the MWA, the Kelvin clamps on the other end of the leads can be connected to the device under test and testing can begin. This concludes lead setup and connections to the Megar MWA 300 series winding analyzer. Visit the Megar YouTube channel for more videos including technical webinars, product overviews, and other how-to presentations similar to this one. Contact us for questions or more information about this topic or for any support you may need for your electrical testing.